All right, here we go. Let's go. I'm gonna have to sort out through sort through all these weapons that I'm getting. here and then I'll go to you one on the other. I can't believe I spent almost an hour monkeying around. They dropped the data module. Looks like the data module's still intact. Joker can transmit this info to your Alliance command. We just spent the better part of an hour looking through monkeys. I mean... That's legendary stuff right there. Alright. Yes. Right, because I'm using Infiltrator, I should be using a sniper rifle anyway. Are we done? I don't think we're done. No more monkeying around.
Yes, Commander? Yes, sir. Let's go, let's go. I mean, I love you, Hackett, but please don't call me. Don't call me back to the Citadel. Message coming in. Patching it through. Commander Shepard, my name is Nasana Dantius. I have a job for you. I can't say anymore in an unsecured communication. If you're interested in hearing my offer, meet me on the Citadel so we can talk in person. I'll be waiting in the diplomat's lounge on the Presidium. Whatever. Let's go. Amazing watching, like watching your dog on the Citadel. Take Garrus and Caden. Uh, Equalizing interior pressure with exterior, exterior atmosphere. atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has, has the, deck. the deck. Oh. <laughs> oh. Let's talk to Kohuku. Oh no, that's not Kohuku. That's Mikhailovich. Scan the keepers. We've already scanned that keeper. You know what? I'm gonna play it. I'm gonna play it and then reload it. That's why I saved. Ten hut! At ease. Rear Admiral Mihailovic, 5th Fleet. <laughs> what do you want? <laughs> I'm on urgent business with the Citadel. Is there something you need? Let's get one thing clear, Shepard. You might be a specter to the aliens, but to me, you're just another junior officer. <laughs> I command the 63rd Scout Flotilla. You and the Normandy were slated for my unit after shakedown. And the Council got their paws, claws, tentacles, whatever. They got them on our ship and you. I wasn't keen on it either. But there are advantages to being above the law. <laughs> don't let the title go to your head. No one's above the law. I don't begrudge the politician's decision to throw you to the council. It's an opportunity. I do begrudge this over-designed piece of tin, though. <laughs> this ship saved our lives a dozen times over. An exaggeration. I've read your reports. This experiment diverted billions from our appropriations bills for the same price we could have had a heavy cruiser. But no, we had to make nice to the Turians, throw money at a co-developed boondoggle. I'm here to make an inspection, Commander. Normandy is an Alliance warship. I intend to see she's up to snuff. I don't think so. <laughs> Normandy is an Alliance warship, but she's on loan to the Citadel. That means she's not in your chain of command. I believe there's something wrong with my ears. Did you just contradict me? This ship is council property right now, so respectfully, please clear the gangway. Have it your way, Commander, but expect me to file a report on this. <laughs> Renegade, son. 
I used to have an office here. Spent half my time doing paperwork. Nice to see so many humans working for CSEC. Oh, egotistical shepherd. Let's, let's reload and do it right. That is Rear Admiral Mihailovic, 5th Fleet. We weren't told to expect you, sir. I would have prepared a formal greeting. Spare me the pleasantries. I command the 63rd Scout Flotilla. You and the Normandy were slated for my unit after shakedown. Then the Council got their paws, claws, tentacles, whatever. They got them on our ship and you. Think I still serve the Alliance, sir. As a Spectre, I can advance our interests to the Council. <laughs> you still know what color your blood is, Shepard? I don't begrudge the politician's decision to throw you to the Council. It's an opportunity. I do begrudge this over-designed piece of tin, though. The Normandy is a fine ship, sir. She's served us well so far. It's a gimmick, Commander. Useless in a stand-up fight. This experiment diverted billions from our appropriations bills for the same price we could have had a heavy cruiser. But no. We had to make nice to the Turians, throw money at a co-developed boondoggle. I'm here to make an inspection, Commander. Normandy is an Alliance warship. I intend to see she's up to snuff. Please do. We'd be honored to show her to you, Admiral. I'll just bet. Wait here. I won't be long. Commander, I'm not happy. <laughs> I bet. I'm sorry to hear that, sir. Who designed that CIC? Putting the commander aft of everyone else is inefficient. What if he needs to discuss with the operators toward the bow? <laughs> Modified Turian style. They prefer commanders looking over their subordinates rather than in the middle of them. We wanted to see how effectively they can command with that setup. Mm, reasonable goal, but they should have studied that in a lab rather than on a frontline warship. I had to shake my head at that drive core of yours. 120 billion credits at element zero to make this thing able to move without giving itself away. You realize we could make drive cores for 12,000 fighters with that money? What good is it to hide for a few hours anyway? Useless! We can loiter in an enemy system and monitor traffic, or drop infiltration teams on enemy worlds. Normandy can be more effective than the Solarian STG. Maybe, maybe. But that's not the job of a proper warship. We're supposed to find and kill the enemy fleet, not count how many times their garrison goes to the bathroom. And we need to talk about your crew, Commander. Krogan? Turians? What are you thinking, Commander? You can't allow alien nationals free access to Alliance equipment? Between Saren and the Geth, we have enough enemies out here. Treating other species with suspicion and distrust won't win hearts and minds. That assumes the hearts and minds are worth winning. That hasn't been proven yet. You have anything else to say, Commander? Any other justifications for the state of this vessel? I think we need to build is bridges. a good ship, sir. Even if you disagree, you have to see that her joint construction and multiracial crew make the Alliance look better. Your job is to look good, Commander. The Alliance Navies is to win wars. I'm not convinced Normandy isn't a waste of taxpayer money, but I am convinced that you believe otherwise, and that you'll use it to its best ability. I'll be submitting a report to the Joint Military Council. It will not be as negative as I planned. Good hunting, Commander Shepard. Make us proud. <laughs> Paragon. After years of poor economic performance, <laughs> Exogeny has announced that its research colony on Pharos is finally returning a profit. New discoveries and a dedicated colonization effort have finally paid off <sighs> for Exogeny. Exogeny's stock rose sharply with the announcement, with investors pleased at this surprising news.
Oh god. This is a chick. Commander Shepard? Kalisa been seen in Al Jalani, Westerland News. Would you answer a few questions for our viewers? All right. What do you want to know? You've been given a unique position to represent our race. People want to get a sense of how you'll do that. Humans have been trying to get the respect of the galactic community for 26 years. With that in mind, what are your feelings on being the first human specter? Honored. The specters represent the best of every species in the galaxy. To be asked to join them is an honor. Some have said your appointment is the Citadel throwing humans a bone. Have you encountered any situations where the Citadel asked you to place its needs before the needs of Earth? Mm. It's not like that. The Council is concerned with the needs of the whole galactic community. We're part of that community now. Our needs are on their agenda, but we're one of many. You really do believe that, don't you? You've been given command of an advanced human warship for your missions. Is there anything you'd like to say about it? <laughs> Time to shut you up. Actually, the Normandy was co-developed by human and Turian engineers. Its design incorporates many innovations, all of which are classified, I'm afraid. So, the Turians have knowledge of the Normandy that is being kept secret from the Alliance public? Do you think it was appropriate to hand Earth's most advanced warship over to the Citadel? Huh. We should hit her. This is the lady we can hit, isn't she? Like I said, I've played this game, but you know, let's, let's play- It had been handed over to anyone. I'm in command, and last I checked, I'm human. Same goes for my crew. Human, yes, but you do work for the Citadel now, Commander. One last question, Commander. Rumors back home say you're tracking a rogue specter named Sarah. Do you have any comment on that? Saren instigated the attack on our colony at Eden Prime. Once his involvement was proven to the Council, I was assigned to bring him in. That's surprising, Commander. The official line, Eden Prime, was a... Good luck in your mission. Thank you for your time, Commander Shepard. Huh. Sentinel, I'll... I'm gonna have to look at all these trophies are. Maybe I should have hit her in the face. Hello, Commander. Show Need me what supply. you've got. I'll open the rare stocks for you, Commander. Enjoy. Compare. Oh no. Look at our current sniper rifle. Alright. We need more resources before we can start spending. Presidium. Let's well, Garrus. Any regrets about leaving Citadel security? Fighting a rogue specter with countless lives at stake and no regulations to get in the way? I'd say that beats CSEC. Well, we don't lack for excitement, that's for sure. <laughs> uh, one of many, many elevator chats. Right, the lady. A sorry diplomat. She's here at the Presidium, isn't she? Lounge. I can't believe I landed a job here. This place is fantastic. Human, delighted, welcome. It is good to meet you. Scan the keeper. I 
Executive Palance. So they finally did it. I knew one of your kind would make Spectre one day. I only hope you're better than the one they're sending you after. I'll do everything I can to stop Saren. Hmm. That's what worries me. Was there something you want? <laughs> <laughs> Executive Palos. He, he's, it sounds like what they say. I'll be going. Goodbye, there. Commander. Gareth's father. He's hostile to people above the wall. I mean, technically, you should. We should all be alarmed at people above the law. Because that's how tyrants take over and enslave us all. Oh, I just scanned the keeper without even thinking about it. There she is. Commander Shepard, I am Nasana Dantius. I see you got my message. It sounded like you needed some help. I do. My sister Dahlia is a crewman on the cargo vessel operating out beyond the fringes of the Traverse. Her ship was attacked by privateers. There were no reported survivors. That's too bad. I'm sorry for your loss. This is where it gets complicated. Last week, I received a message with her voice on it. Dahlia is alive. The rest of the crew was killed, but she was taken prisoner. The slavers demanded a huge ransom from me in exchange for returning her unharmed. Why was your sister Why didn't the raiders kill Dahlia along with everyone else? My sister probably told them who she was. My family's very wealthy, Shepard. They must have realized she was worth more to them alive. <laughs> Coming up with the ransom seems like the best way to ensure Dahlia's safety. That's what I thought. I did what they wanted. Transferred the funds to the account they specified. Only they never released her. They haven't contacted me since. I've made a terrible mistake, Shepard. I'm a diplomatic emissary. By law, I'm required to report any attempted extortion to CSEC immediately. But... I was afraid for Dahlia, so I just paid the ransom. Now she's still missing. And if anyone finds out what I did, I could end up in jail. Uh, I could say that's a stupid law, but... And it is. Actually, in the United States, FBI tells people not to pay ransoms. Why would they put you in jail? A You're lot the of people here. do that. Government representatives on the Citadel are not allowed to negotiate with terrorists. It's too dangerous. Paying a ransom would only encourage more kidnappings. I support right. the law in theory, but when I got the message, all I could think about was Dahlia's safety. I doubt they would actually send me to prison for what I did, but they would strip me of my post, and Dahlia would still be in the hands of the slavers. You need my help. You want me to find her and bring her back? You only need to bring her back. I've already found her for you. I tracked the ransom payment through several accounts. Eventually, it led to a small mercenary band operating out of the Artemis Tau Cluster. I need you to go to the Merc base, take them out, and bring my sister back. You shall be well rewarded. Anything you can tell me about the Mercs who have your sister? Mm. Pretty much what you'd expect. Rough, dangerous, and well-armed. Nothing a Spectre cannot handle, though. Can't you hire someone else to do this? I do not want to take chances with my sister's life. I need a Spectre. Besides, you operate outside official channels. My superiors cannot find out I never reported the ransom in the first place. How'd you find out who was behind the ransom? I have resources. Contacts and credits can go a long way. Especially if you're willing to bend the rules. I already broke the law when I paid the ransom. This couldn't make things any worse. Alright. Keep your reward. I'll bring your sister back. I promise. Thank you, Shepard. I knew you were the right man for the job. Come back and see me when the job is done. Hmm. Yes, Shepard? Did you find my sister? I have to go. Come back and see me when the job is done. This place seems strange. I wish there were more humans around. Mm. Sip of water. All right, let's go. Well, actually, let's talk to other people.
I saw your fellow's report. If we had known anything about the Thorian, Exogeny would never have been given the permits to start a colony there. Thank God the colony survived. We can't afford to have too many failures out in the Traverse. It's one of our major expansion regions. <laughs> You don't give a damn about the colonists. It's all just politics to you, isn't it? We can't all be the hero who charges in to save the day, Commander. But we each serve humanity in our own way. You can't escape interstellar politics. It's part of the big picture, and sometimes it isn't pretty. Just ignore him, Shepard. The Ambassador's a little bitter sometimes. Comes with the job. Yes, Commander? You okay? How are you holding up? Honestly, this isn't how I pictured my career coming to an end. Pushing papers really isn't my thing, but you're the one who can stop, Sarah. I believe in you, Shepard. If that means I have to step aside, so be it. I should go. I'll be here if you need anything. Scan the Keeper. Strained greeting, human. What's you wrong? seem distressed. Is there something I can do to help? Alarmed response. You overheard that, did you? This is all going so wrong. And it is the Asari Consort's fault. She's the one who started all this. What did this Asari do to get you so upset? I cannot speak more about this problem. It is too sensitive. Suffice it to say, she has compromised my authority as a diplomat. Where is she? Where can I find the Sasari consort? She is across the bridge from here. Her offices are easy enough to spot. Good day, human. <laughs> The Earth-clad Spectre has returned to speak with me. Goodbye, Ambassador. Yes, yes. Good day, Earth-clan. <laughs> Earth-clan. The writing of this game is so amazing. I mean, the aliens are actually compelling. Like, the way they speak. Resolve the disputes. <laughs> Let's go to the ward. You're gone away. Word on the street is that you've been busy. Congratulations on taking down Fist. I was sure he was a big player in anything going on here. Did you find anything in his office that could help me? <laughs> These OSDs might have the information you're looking for. <sighs> you've got Fist's files? This could be even bigger than I'd hoped. Here, Commander, for your trouble. Yeah. 
What would my future cooperation be worth? Say, an interview when my investigation is over? Exclusive? You talk to me before you talk to anyone else? That would be worth quite a bit, and I'd be very happy to compensate you accordingly. Here you are. Now, if you'll excuse me, I should go see what's on these discs. I can't believe I, this is the first time I came I back to this game and I, don't sell this I just pretty much I monkeyed around. <laughs> okay, there's another Hannah. Um, Keeper. Sorry. Is that really? Your Commander Shepard, the hero of Eden oh, Prime. Conrad I am so honored to meet you. Nice to meet you. And you are? My name is Conrad. Conrad Werner. They say you killed more than a hundred Geth on Eden Prime. <laughs> I spend most of the time trying to stay alive and help the colonists. Hey, I know you're probably busy, but um, do you have time for a quick autograph? Ah, uh, no problem. Anything for a fan? Here. Thanks. I really appreciate it. My wife is going to be so impressed. I'll let you get back to work. Oh, but next time you're on Earth, I'd love to buy you a drink. Thanks again. Hmm. The fan, Conrad Werner. You probably haven't seen the last of Conrad Werner. What harm could there be in talking with him if you meet again? Hello there, welcome to Moreland's famous shop. You want many good supplies, yes? Let me see what you have. Oh, you will be pleased, I think. Very good things I have. You will see. Mm. Compare. Eh, let's get out of here. You know what, let's actually go do missions. Let's go. Let's go to CSEC. We're leaving this place. Let's go get Liara. Can't believe I spent the entire video just messing about. Mm. Docking bay. Saren was one of the most respected Turians in the galaxy, Garrus. You gonna be okay going up against him? Saren is either a traitor or a madman. Taking him down will restore the good name of Turians everywhere. Just keep saying that, especially to humans. We've got a lot of angry people right now. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in progress. Ah, the power of the PS4. Logged. The commanding officer is aboard. Exo Presley stands relieved. I remember playing this um, on the 360. This was like 2008, 2009. 
and that decontamination in progress went on like five times. You know what? I think I'm gonna stop the video here and continue later. Thanks for watching. Sorry it wasn't as eventful. But next we're gonna go look for Liara, so... This video is presented by the Let's Roll Podcast. Link in description below. Follow us on all of our social media. Thank you for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment down below, and hit that notification button. See you in the next video.